Hello guys, welcome to Angel Works 3110. Thank you for joining me on this channel. My name is Gladys and this is your new moon message for all the zodiac signs. The new moon is going into Taurus coming out of Aries. Aries is the time to take action. So you guys just recently took some action with this last new moon. The action was taken and you're trying to manifest your dreams. The new moon causes you to have to set intentions in order for it to manifest and the prosperity lies ahead in the new moon in Taurus so you're going to be focusing on your finances and getting things paid off or saving money the new moon marks the start of the waxing cycle and the midpoint of the dark moon it's a dark and veiled time when the new moon is invisible in a time of rebirth, it's time to do your work to manifest the things that you want to come to fruition. Set your intentions clearly. Set goals. Make lists. Check them off. And watch them come true by writing down your intentions and manifesting what it is that you want the world to see. There is action that is going to be taken, and it could have something to do with your finances. I hope you guys are enjoying your time in quarantine. Please join me at 8 o'clock every evening for Howling at the Moon. If you have not seen the playlist on Howling at the Moon, go watch that and check it out. And in the meantime, we are going to start off with all the zodiac signs. Hello Virgos, thank you for joining me. This message is for Virgos, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Mars, or any aspects in your birth chart. So go check out your birth chart and see where Virgo lands in your birth chart. If your birthday is August 23rd through September the 22nd, you are a Virgo. If you're on the cusp, you're at the end of the 23rd and 22nd. What I'm picking up is somebody is in their head about some offer that was given to them and it came to an end. There was judgment upon someone based on hearsay, but there's justice going to be served. Somebody's trusting their intuition. You're dealing with someone that is very intuitive, psychic, a spiritual teacher. You could be in your head about the person that you thought was your one. It could have been that you thought that someone was your one and they really wasn't. And it was the other person that you really didn't pay no attention to. That you really didn't care about. At the time they were offering this, you didn't realize that they would be your one. But you're finding this out. Cycles have ended. And new cycles are beginning and this is 2020 2020 everyone is going to see things clearer this year we are being forced to see things clear by the universe things are happening in life where we are having to be quarantined with our significant other or with ourselves to find out and figure out the cycles that we need to end in our life in order to bring in the right kind of situation. Okay. You can go ahead in Virgos. This is for Virgos. I hope you guys are enjoying your quarantine time. If you have not seen the wanting moon messages, go check them out because that will help you know what do you need to release in order to get this to come to fruition, this new moon message. Because you want to set your intentions so that your manifestations can come true. This is for Virgos. There you are popping out, wanting the truth in the situation. 
trying to get clarification during this hermit mode time. Okay. I need an angel message for you guys. Check out the other videos. If this one, this one doesn't resonate, I will be posting angel messages as well and Earth Day messages. Tomorrow is, or it's today actually, Earth Day. Okay, we'll start off with your message. We got temperance. You're in your head about want to have an equal give and take relationship. Trying to balance things out in your situation. The universe is helping you out and going to balance things, balance things out. You've been through a lot of cycles where things were not balanced out and you're having things balance out now for the better. A lot of the people that are viewing this is going to be getting just and have the balance come out. And you're going to be much happier and loving life. You're dealing with somebody that is childlike, that is in the limelight, that likes a lot of attention, that does do equal give and take in a situation. Oh, we got the star card. Somebody liking to be in the limelight. You're dealing with somebody that is in the limelight. You're dealing with an Aquarius. You're dealing with somebody that is having hope in a situation, hoping for the best when it comes to emotions there could have been a third party situation and someone sees the light and they're seeing their star their wish come true it's time to celebrate because your wishes are coming true at this time because you are with the person that you want to be with in quarantine locked up down with and it's very emotional an emotional time emotional state the king of cups knows how to control their emotions. You're dealing with somebody that can manifest their dreams, manifest a love situation. Here's somebody wanting to offer someone a cup of love, a big cup of love. Someone is financially coming to help. Someone that is just there with emotions. Maybe they don't have pentacles and this person needs Sorry for that interruption. Anyway, I'm back. There could have been an earth sign that offered love to a water sign. You thought it was time to celebrate. This was like your wish come true. This person was way younger than you. You thought that you guys could balance things out. There's victory in the situation with a fire sign or someone likes attention or you see someone on a high horse you're ready to commit to someone that is very high has high standards with a lot of burdens going on this person have could be a hard worker has a lot going on but they achieve their goals because they set goals and they achieve them they make lists they do a lot of tasks they are into a lot of things they help a lot they help a lot of people they are being burdened by a lot of attention they don't like the attention Someone's going to be giving somebody a lot of attention that has a lot of burdens upon them. This person could seem like they're all uppity up and having everything good going for them. But really they have a lot of burdens going on behind the scenes. It, they portray in front of everyone like they've got it all going on and everything's all good. But in reality 
behind closed doors, they are burdened with some kind of burdens. Oh, here's victory again. The chariot's coming in. And someone's standing their ground. Someone stood their ground about a situation. And it, they hold themselves in high regard. They know the direction they want to go in. They know how to manifest their wishes to come true. They do take on a lot of burdens. They do stand their ground a lot. They have been through a lot. In life learned a lot of lessons in life but they figured out how they want to balance things out with you or you are special with them this person is your wish come true there's a lot of hope in this situation for growth for romance your romantic situation is coming to an end because you are no longer going to be alone. You have found a partner that will meet you halfway. That is an equal give and take. It is time to celebrate. There's no more third party situations. Someone could be getting pregnant. Someone could be with child. There could be a move. Moving in together. A proposal of moving in together. Moving your relationship to the next level romantically. Feeling like you can trust this person. Feeling safe around this person. Knowing that they're not going to be a player. Not going out and celebrating with others. Only giving their love to you. Celebrating in a close-knit union of a small gathering. You are dealing with a king of wands, a fire sign, or this is you, somebody taking charge. Someone has been through a lot, like I said, emotionally in a lot of relationships in and out, learned a lot of lessons and figured out how to become this king. They put a lot of their emotions, they are very loyal They put a lot of of stuff, how do I want to say it? I just feel like this person is very passionate toward you. Very deeply, they are very loyal, they are like a friend. You could have known them as a friend first. You could have met them in a, in a place where you're, you were drinking, where you were celebrating. You could have thought this person was way too young for you. Someone's going to take charge in the situation to make their dreams come true and manifest their dreams. To have a victory in the situation. They're wanting an equal give and take when it comes to a love partner. They want equal give and take when it comes to finances as well. This person don't care to stand up for what is right. They do have a lot of burdens upon them. They're hoping that someone can help them relieve them of this burden that they are dealing with. Your angel message is Ray. Yoga and exercise are essential to your well-being, peace of mind, and spiritual growth right now. So it is time for you to start doing some kind of yoga, some kind of exercise. You need to have some kind of regimen going on for your well-being so you can have peace of mind. You need to have spiritual growth right now. You are in a relationship that is way different than your normal relationship. This is a very different kind of union that you're with, with someone. You're very emotionally a attached to this person. You don't realize that this person that you're interested in 
does have a lot of burdens. They're holding it within. They don't want to burden you with their burdens. <clears throat> you make them feel at peace. You give them hope for a brighter future. You're planning a future with this person. You want children with this person. This, you like that they stand their ground. You like that they are action-oriented, that they are romantic, that they take action, they achieve their goals. This is a time for you to travel. You could be going horseback riding. That's all I'm picking up for you guys. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. And always remember, guys, treat others the way you want to be treated. God bless.